Fill in the blanks, listening and writing. Common mistakes. In fill in the blanks, listening and writing, you will see a transcript of the recording with four to six blanks. You will listen to the recording and type the missing words you hear into the gaps. In fill in the blanks, listening and writing tasks, what are some common mistakes to avoid? Losing your place in the transcript. Not checking what you've written. Let's look at these in more detail. Common mistake one, losing your place in the transcript. Look at the question and listen to the test taker during the test. Why did they miss the word in the second gap? We've known for a while that those with proficiency in playing a musical instrument exhibit superior brain plasticity. That is, their brain can change and adapt as a result of experience. However, we recently investigated the distinction between drummers and non musicians. The test taker spent too long writing the second word. They didn't follow the transcript and lost their place. Follow the transcript as it is spoken. You must keep moving along with what you hear. Focusing on one word for too long will mean you lose your place in the transcript. To avoid falling behind, write abbreviations of what you hear and complete them after the recording has finished. Common mistake two not checking what you've written. The test taker has completed all their answers. What should they do now? Just click next. Read the text again quickly, checking the words they typed for spelling, grammar and meaning. Remove any words they are unsure of and leave those gaps blank. The test taker should read the text again quickly, checking the words they typed for spelling, grammar and meaning. Make changes if you need to, but only if you are sure something is incorrect. If you are unsure about a word, write something based on the sounds you hear. The test taker should not Click next without checking what they have written. Only do this if you are very low on time. And the test taker should not remove any words and leave a gap. Instead, guess an answer if you are unsure. You won't lose points for incorrect answers in this task. In summary, to follow the transcript successfully, read along as you listen. Don't focus for too long on one gap. Write an abbreviation of what you hear and complete it after the recording ends. Check what you've written. Think about spelling, grammar and meaning. Write something based on the sounds you heard if you are unsure. 